Welcome to Express Out. My name is Ryan. If you guys are joining for the first time, quick 15 minute workout here. We'll do a, a variety of exercises. We just completed the Exos workout of the day. Um, fantastic job to you guys that joined. I know the weekend is a little bit longer. So if you guys felt like it was a little bit tougher, it's probably just because of those extra days that we were sitting around eating our, our pie and our turkey, which is what exactly what I did. So it's a good way to get a sweat in. Sorry, Monday's off right. Getting a little core work in. What you'll need for this, we're going to do series, uh, three different uh, series. This first series, um, you'll need a little lighter weight. And uh, if you don't have a weight around you, like you can grab a tennis shoe. You can grab a pillow. Um, it doesn't need to be heavy, like two pounds, one pound, five pounds max, something very light. Um, and I don't have anything light, so I'm actually just going to use this foam roller I have here. So the first exercise that we're going to do, we're going to start from like kind of a Russian twist position. We're not going to start, the first exercise is not going to be Russian twist. We're going to do uh, wood chops, we're kind of going across the body. So what we're going to do is this. Uh, this foam roller or your weight that you choose. Oh, it's, it's hard to see. I'll fix something that you guys can see in the camera. And then I'll go and switch it up. Okay, hopefully you guys can see this maybe. A little bit better, has a little color to it. I'm gonna have this weight right here for this object. I'm gonna start from my left and go to my right. Start from my left, go to my right. So notice how this thing is starting outside of my left shoulder and then rotating all the way to my right hip. Outside left shoulder, right hip. Outside left shoulder, right hip. Now I'm just going to work here for 15 seconds. The entire time my eyes are following the dowel or whatever weight that you have going across my body. 15 seconds there, and then we're going to switch. Outside the shoulder to my hip. Outside the shoulder to my hip. I'm keeping my feet down for this because I want to keep some stability there. But then I'm just focusing eyes, hip. Eyes on the object in front of you. So... 15 seconds one way, 15 seconds the other way. Last one, rush and twist. Hip to hip, rotating there. Working again, you'll need a lighter weight or a lighter object, like even a pillow, your tennis shoes, because we're gonna be going above the head, but make sure your eyes are following that object as you rotate across. And my timer's missing, awesome. Okay, 15 seconds, let me put on the clock here real quick. It. Right. Time are you losing between? Here we go. Let's get my timer rolling. 15 seconds on the clock. I'm going to start left to right. Above shoulder left, bottom right. Here we go. 15 seconds. Three, two, one. We're going. Well, the shoulder to the hip, left to right. Sit upright, keeping those feet down. Two, one, relax, gonna go right to left. Two, one, we're going. Not a lot of time in between. Just a light weight in our hand. Two, one, relax, Russian twist, hip to hip. Two, one, we're going, hip to hip. Eyes follow those hands. Keep my feet down. Two, one, relax. There's set number one. We'll see if it sets more than one, so we'll come back to that one. Next round we're gonna do, now we're gonna do some straight on exercises. The first one we're gonna do is knee tucks. My hands are gonna be behind me. My legs are gonna be extended. I tuck my knees in, tuck my knees out. And I'm working here. I keep my hands behind me for that position to allow me to lean back. It helps me push the lean forward, but my core is going to feel that work as my knees come in to out for those knee tucks. After that, we're going to do sliders or half crunches. Feet are going to be down, skip a little bit. Feet are going to be down, arms are going to be straight. Going to just have my hands, my shoulders come off the ground, slide up, slide down, work in there. Have my torso get those shoulders off the ground. I keep my low back pushed in the entire time. And then the last one, toe touches. Easy one, feet up, rapid fire. Hands touching those toes, getting those shoulders off the ground quick. 
Boom, 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 rapid fire there. Knee tuck, sliders, toe touches, quick transitions in between. All right, here we go. Knee tucks here in three, two, one, rolling out to in. Just 15 seconds here. Two, one, relax, land your back, sliders, those neck crunches, arms straight, shoulders up the ground. Two, one, we're going. Two, one, relax, toe touch and speed up. Two, one, we're rolling, go, go, go. Rapid fire, get those shoulders off the ground. Two, one, relax. Oh, all right. Third series. Now we're going to stability. The first one we're gonna do is a hollow hold. You guys have seen these before. These ones are difficult, but I'll show you guys how to make them perfect for you. We're gonna be laying on our back. The key to this exercise is to push this low back to the ground so my hand can't slide underneath it. Your back arches up, your hand slides in, you're not working your core. We don't want that. Push the low back down, hand can't fit underneath, we're in good position here. My arms are going to be straight, my shoulders are going to the ground, my legs are going to be straight, and I'm going to hang out. If you want to make this easier, raise your feet up. If you want to make this harder, lower your feet down. But the main thing is, is your back can't come off the ground. It's got to be pushed in. 15 seconds there. After that, we're rolling on over to the point position. Everyone's knees off the ground. It's 15 seconds. We can do it today. Squeeze that core, body in good alignment, holding that position. And then the last one we're going to do are dead bugs. So we're going to roll back to our back. Knees are going to be tucked. Arms are going to be up. I'm going to extend one arm, one leg. Extend one arm. One leg. The goal of this one, again, back, low back, push from the ground. As you extend the leg out, keep that control of your low back. Don't let it arch. Push it down, and then bring it on back. Opposite arm, opposite leg are doing the moving. Your core is stabilizing. So we have hollow holds, planks, dead bugs. Boom, boom, boom. 15 seconds apiece. Let's get it here. Start out those hollow holds. So, low back on the ground, shoulders off the ground, feet are straight. Let's hit it here in two, one, we're rolling. Just 15 seconds. Raise your feet up if it's too difficult. Lower it down, make it a little harder. Two, one, relax, roll into a plank. Off your knees here, let's get it. Two, one, we're rolling, 15 seconds, you guys got this. Squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Short time here already. Two, one, relax, roll on over, dead bugs. Here we go, two, one, roll on. Opposite arm, opposite leg are moving. Don't be moving two arms or two legs at the same time. It's just one arm and one leg, opposite of one another. Two, one, relax. Nice. All right. We took up a lot of time going to the first round. We're going to try to get through as far as we can another round of that. So you're going to grab that light weight again for those wood chops. Again, outside your left to your right hip. Make sure your eyes are following the object in your hand. So it's going to be left to right, right to left, and then Russian twist. Keep guys a little, we'll go in 20 seconds. We're gonna go try to get through all three of them real quick here. You guys know the exercises? We're gonna pick up that pace. Finish off the workout on the right now. All right, grab your object, left to right. Here we go, three, two, one, we're going. Squeeze that core. 
Ball that left shoulder, two got right hip. Eyes are falling in those hands. Two, one, relax. Here we go, right to left. Two, one, we're hitting it. Again, hopefully there's a little light object so you can focus on squeezing your core as you rotate. Two, one, relax. Russian twist. Two, one, I'm hitting it. Hip to hip, two, one, relax. Whew. Put that out to the side. Gonna go to the abdominal straight forward. Gonna, gonna go to knee tucks, sliders, and toe touches. I'll give you like 20 seconds and then we'll hit it. Hands are gonna start behind you. Just bring those knees in, extending them out. Here we go. Let's hit it here. Three. Two, one, we're hitting it. 15 seconds of each. Nice job. Get a lot of repetitions in. Two, one, relax. Lay on your back, sliders. Here we go. Two, one, we're working. Shoulders off the ground. Let the torso do that work, not your neck. Two, one, relax. Feet up. Two, one, we're hitting it. Rapid fire, go, go, go. Two, one, relax. Whoa. Oh, one more. One more series real quick. Hollow holds, planks, dead bugs. Remember, low back on the ground. It's going to be a little tougher here right at the end. So if you need to raise your feet up a little higher, especially for the, uh, the, the hollow holds, do so. 15 seconds. We'll get going. All right, here we go. Feet up. Shoulders up the ground. Two. One. We're hitting it. Squeeze the hold, hang out. Happy Monday. Low back pushed in. Raise your feet up if you need to. Short time. Two, one, relax. Roll over to the planks. Here we go. Two, one, we're working. Squeeze and hold. Nice job. Be solid, be strong. Two, one, relax. Go to dead bugs. Last one here today. Opposite arm, opposite leg. Here we go. Two, one, we're working. Control. Slow and control. Two, one, relax. Woo! Sit over here. <laughs> well, thank you guys for joining us today for Express Abs. Our next class will be at 8.30 a.m. tomorrow morning, metabolic conditioning. Um, again, fantastic job. If you guys complete the Exos workout of the day, if you haven't yet, it'll be posted to our Instagram or our YouTube later today. Uh, and our 2021, 2021 countdown program participants, awesome job working out last week, keeping track of your totals. Have another great start to your week. If you haven't joined the program yet, you still want to. We have plenty of time before the end of the year to continue working with you and kind of start your 2021 on the right note. Um, take care and have a great start to the week.